ma'am, have seen much of our work in the last two years, and we were very deeply honored when you became our patron last April. In that time, if I may say so, you have shared our fortunes and our sorrows, and of course we are delighted that you're here with us today to present the first Relate Family of the Year Award. Well, Hannes. Ladies and gentlemen, I must admit to having been rather puzzled when I heard of the Family of the Year Award. I hadn't realized that family life was a competition, let alone one which we got prizes for. <laughs> However, I quickly discovered that far from singling out one perfect example of family life, the award is really intended as a tribute to the thousands of families whose daily lives are constructive, loving, and unselfish. These are the families who give of their best to each other and to society, while quietly coping with the daunting array of pressures. In this room, there is no shortage of experts on the subject of marriage breakdown. I'm sure that they all have at their fingertips the statistics which prove the damage of divorce, felt in education, employment, crime, even in the national economy. I know also from my own visits to their offices around the country that the experts of Relate have daily contact with the distress which underlies these statistics. Marriage offers stability, and maybe that is why nearly 7,000 couples a week begin new family lives of their own. Sadly, for many of these marriages, reality fails to live up to expectations. When that happens, most couples discover and draw on new reserves of love and strength. But for many, their own resources are just not enough. More than mere guidance, Relate offers some marriages the, su the support which will strengthen them to overcome a crisis. To others, it offers hope through and after divorce. In short, Relate helps people keep going. In ways too often unnoticed, its work enriches and supports the fabric of society. This may all seem a far cry from the family of the year, but we should remember that the award celebrates the victory of very simple values over the very complex difficulties confronted by so many modern marriages. I offer my congratulations to all families who remain cheerful, positive, and loving in adversity. And I also offer my support to everyone who helps them in this task. May I now invite Sue Cook, presenter of Daytime Live, to announce the selection panel's decision and to call up the families to receive their awards. Thank you very much, uh, Your Royal Highness, my lords, ladies and gentlemen. I'm delighted to be here today to play a very small part in these very important proceedings. And I'd also like to add how much our camera crews enjoyed visiting the three families to make the films that you saw earlier. But let's now put an end to all the suspense. I have the selector's decision here. And before I announce the family of the year, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to invite representatives of the other two families, the Beestons from Red Car and the Lochlands from Gallicare, to come up and collect their awards. means that Relate's Family of the Year is the Gopal family from Colchester in Essex. So
So would Heather, Rico, Rico Jr., Ryan, Ricky and Rosita please come forward to the family of the year award. It remains now only for me to thank those who have made this event and the award possible. First of all, of course, our partners at Women's Own, and in particular, Keith McNeil and Angela Willans. Our principal sponsors, Raphael Ginogli, Michael Ashcroft of ADT, and Denise Bell King of Belle Epoque. Sue Cook, Simon Shaw, and the team of Daytime Live at BBC Pebble Mill. The Family of the Year team, led by Relates Vice Chairman Anne Leck. The finalist families, the Beastons, the Gopals, and the Lochlins. My colleague Peter McCabe and his team, who have worked night and day to make this event a success. And most especially, ma'am, may I thank you for the honor of your presence today and for so graciously presenting the award for us. And very finally, may I thank you all for coming, for making the event such a success, and for your support of Relate. Thank you very much indeed. <laughs>